What's going on YouTube? For everyone goes here bringing you another awesome video. Today I'm being, well, awesome today and reviewing this movie or show series, El Reca 7, Astral Ocean. For short, El Reca 7 AL. Uh, people wanted me to review it. So this is the second season of El Reca 7. This is the second chapter of the series, which is again, one of the favorites of mine. And it's a little different. <clears throat> very different in a sense. I'll give you a little detail into it, and then uh, I'll honestly give you my opinion on it, and we'll go from there. So pretty much Astral Ocean is the story of Ea, which is the character right in front of you, who you already may or may not know, is Elreka's son, and Renton's son. You see, he lives a normal life in a small island close to Japan or Tokyo. I'm not sure which of the two. Or maybe he's just in a regular island somewhere in the South Pacific, I'm not sure. Uh, please let me know in the comments below so that I know. Anyway, pretty much from there, he knows nothing about his, well, he, well, not as much. Well, doesn't know much about his mother until his uh, adopted father tells him about what happened during the times of his mom's labor and stuff like that. And pretty much he starts finding out things that he never knew, discovered about himself, what he was. And many other great things about that. So anyway, <clears throat> it's a very confusing show, to be very honest with you guys. I kind of wish that they kind of went with the uh, uh, Areca 7 2.0 to that sense, if you guys understand what I'm saying. Because if any of you have watched AO, you know that it, it is confusing as shit. Because you don't have a clue what's going on. You pretty much are getting thrown in a, in a loop of a mess and you're just continuously continuously thrown into very strange situations this is the entire season for those that want to see it or buy it i think you could purchase this in if you can see that funimation obviously you can buy that there uh hopefully you guys can see that yeah there it is somewhere hopefully it focuses and if it doesn't focus you dummy there you go so if you guys want to purchase this, definitely buy it. It's a great series. I liked it. Honestly, I didn't really uh, understand it as much as I could have. Could have, you know. It's a very good show. It's a very understanding show. But at the same time, it, it kind of confused me more than it actually gave me any knowledge of how everything was going on. Especially how the father came back to his son, and then the mom, how she. <clears throat> went on or passed on i don't know but it, it was very confusing at times and i couldn't understand it that's why i kind of felt like they should have gone with remaking the show right where it, it should have left off how the kids were in the original season one of Areca seven and pretty much decided to tell us how the gecko state went on how the grandfather lived on how anemone went on that's a lot of questions never been answered or had been answered at all so I kind of figured they should do something like that. I, I hope that they do something like that because AO was great, but not amazing. Uh, honestly, if I can rate this, I give it a 7.5. Uh, it's a great show. Uh, it might confuse you very much like it did to me. Uh, it took me a couple of times watching it to really understand it a little bit better. But again, it's a great show all in all. It's not amazing. I mean, I kind of wish they would have gone back to the original storyline with how everything happened, how the kids were left off with. Renton's grandfather, Axel, kind of left off there and explaining how they grown up and how they got bigger, how they became much more adult-like and stuff like that and whatever. But it, it didn't seem to end up like that. It just went straight to a new story, new chapter, all that good stuff. Um, <clears throat> where I put this in my, in my list, a definite top 20 show very easily because it's not like the original series where it's a top 5 or top 10 great show. It was very confusing as I keep re-uttering uh, re to you guys. If you guys like Aureka, you would definitely purchase this as well, like I did. Um, but uh, that's really just um, all I have to say on the show. Definitely a good show to watch. Definitely a good purchase that I got. But uh, make sure that uh, if you like this video, leave a thumbs up on it. And hopefully you sub to my channel for more amazing content like this. And as always, have an amazing rest of the week. Keep being awesome, keep watching anime, and I will be doing another poll today for another review on my uh, next show that you guys want me to review.